while the ai industry is releasing model upon model it is continuing to celebrate breakthrough after breakthrough pouring billions into the latest models and promising revolutionary capabilities there is a critical aspect being systematically overlooked security we are in the midst of an ai gold rush where companies are racing to deploy systems without adequately considering the security implications the focus has been almost entirely on capability can we make models smarter faster more efficient and cheaper but very little attention has been paid to making them secure this week researchers at the university of toronto have come up with something very very eye opening these researchers have delivered a stark reminder of this oversight with their demonstration of gpu hammer the first successful row hammer attack targeting gpu memory what they showed should be a wake up call for the entire industry they managed to take ai models that normally achieve 80% accuracy and reduce them to essentially random guessing with just a single corrupted bit and let that sink in for a moment this isn't theoretical this isn't some distant future threat this is happening right now on hardware that's currently deployed in data centers around the world running the ai services we are increasingly dependent on let me walk through what gpu hammer reveals about the current state of ai security why this should concern everyone building deploying or depending on ai systems please subscribe to the channel and like the video too the ai industry has a security problem and i have no doubt there and it is not just about prompt injection or data poisoning we are building increasingly complex systems and not only systems but the hardware is getting really complex that was never designed with security as a primary concern graphics processors were originally built for rendering video games not for running mission critical ai applications yet here we are deploying ai models for medical diagnosis financial trading autonomous vehicles and <clears throat> countless other critical applications all running on hardware that has fundamental vulnerabilities that most people in the ai space don't even know exist row hammer has been known in the security community for years and years it is not a new thing you can read all about its history and the impact it has done over the years on this wikipedia article and i will drop the link to it in video's description now this row hammer is a serious concern as i have mentioned earlier it's a hardware vulnerability that exploits the physical properties of memory chips by repeatedly accessing specific memory locations you can cause electrical interference that flips bits in a adjacent memory location it's been demonstrated on cpu systems extensively but until now nobody had successfully adopted it for gpu memory the university of toronto researchers Chris Lynn, Joyce Q, and Guru Raj decided to investigate whether this attack could work on GPU memory systems. What they found should terrify anyone responsible for AI system security. GPU memory architecture is actually more complex than CPU memory. It uses GDDR memory with different timing characteristics, higher latency, and faster refresh rates. These different and difference typically makes row hammer attacks more difficult by the way the researchers had to overcome significant technical challenges to make this work they had to reverse engineer how nvidia maps memory addresses developed parallelized attack patterns and achieve activation rates of up to 620000 per refresh period and that is huge this wasn't a trivial work it required deep technical expertise so these researchers 
successfully demonstrated their attack on nvidia a6000 a high-end professional graphic card with 48 gig of gddr6 memory this is exactly the kind of hardware you will find in enterprise data center and i use almost every day on showing you different model installation on the channel here which you can check out now coming back to this what they did was um, their attack produced 8-bit flips across four memory banks in the context of ai models this small number of corrupted bits had catastrophic effects they tested against five ai models including this alexnet uh, vgg16 restnet 50 and few others and all of these are mostly computer vision models used in real world applications and the results were really devastating as i mentioned earlier and the attack is particularly effective against models using 16-bit floating point weights which is a common optimization in modern ai systems when you flip bits in exponent portion of these floating point numbers you can exponentially alter their values a weight that should be 1.5 might become 15 or 150. this change cascades through the entire neural network causing complete system failure now there are few defenses against this gpu hammer but they all come with trade-offs that highlight the security versus performance dilemma facing the ai industry the most straightforward mitigation is enabling error correcting code memory or ecc ecc memory can automatically detect and correct single bit flip errors it's a proven technology that could prevent gpu hammer attacks but it introduces performance penalties of 3 to 10 percent memory overhead of 6.5% and can reduce bandwidth up to 12%. So um, many organizations disable ECC by default precisely because of these performance impacts. So really, I think we have to decide here whether performance is more important or security. And there are a lot of other broader security implications that because GPU hammer represents more than just a single vulnerability. It's a symptom of systematic security neglect in the AI industry, in my humble opinion, because there's a lot of things which are going around. We are building increasingly critical systems on hardware that was never designed for security requirement of modern AI apps. This vulnerability highlights a gap between AI practitioners and security experts. Most AI engineers focus on model architecture, training techniques and performance optimization very few have deep knowledge of hardware security or implications of running ai workloads on shared infrastructure and that is a very critical area this knowledge gap is dangerous as ai systems become more critical to business operations and societal infrastructure the security of the hardware they run on becomes increasingly important we cannot continue to treat security as an afterthought GPU hammer is just a beginning. As AI systems become more valuable targets, we can expect more and more sophisticated attacks against the hardware they run on. The question is whether we are going to learn from this warning and build more secure system or whether we are going to continue to prioritize performance over security until a major incident forces our hand. Let me know your thoughts. I'm very keen to know about them i also want to introduce you to the sponsors of the video who are camel ai camel is an open source community focused on building multi-agent infrastructures for finding the scaling laws with applications in data generation task automation and world simulation please like the video and subscribe to the channel as it helps thank you for watching